What's going on my fellow part-time family? I'm excited. This is probably one of the most hyped Hendrix fishing unboxes you're ever gonna see me do. The box is bigger. The splash pack is bigger. So let's dive in. Let's see what we got. I mean, we're rocking the new threads, guys. So let's take a peek and see in the splash pack first. All right, first thing we did get is this awesome net gator here from Third Eye Fishing. Perfect, keep yourself you know, out of the sun, cool. Then, the main thing in the splash pack, this is worth the value all day long. Wow, okay, we got the drop shot kit featuring the 4.5 inch Dojo Warm. And this is a great color choice. This is that pearls and white, I don't know what they exactly call it. Uh, but they partner with spear point hooks. You get two spear point hooks, two cylinder, uh, cylinder weight, and two ball, sorry, two cylinder weights and two ball weights, all in one beautiful pack. You could take this and go fish. That is the beauty of this. You can grab it, you go, everything you need right in here. The best part about this, I need to work on my drop shotting. Now I can. So, excited about that. Then we got two little goodies in here. One, kind of just explaining, you know, you got, a $21.98 retail value. They say it's $8.99 for the face buff and $12.99 for the kit. That's it guys, $12.99. Plus, if if these kits show up on the Hendrix Fishing website, use code PARTTIME10, you save 10% right there. So beautiful there. Oh, we got ourselves a little love note from Tyler, the owner of Hendrix Fishing, says thank you for your support, always. Uh, and he gives us save 15% with the code below, third eye, Third eye to 15. So you got what guys, use that code instead. Save yourself even more. Get some third eye fishing products. I know they might be not on the side at the moment, but they'll get right back up. But this is the biggest box I have seen from Hendrix Fishing. Oh, oh my, it is absolutely jammed, packed. Okay, so first things first, we got a third eye fishing sticker. That's gonna go on the bait wall. We have our card. It is full. Oh boy. $59.90 in retail value. Oh boy, okay, let's see what we got. Okay, we got that same discount code, a little thank you from Tyler there, the owner. Oh man, first thing, right out the bat, I'm loving the color. This is the June Bug 4.5 inch Dojo Worm. I'm gonna pull one out. It has the Bass sir Syrup from Z Bait Co. Love their packing, very professional. The best part guys, these, these are not big retailer guys. These are small bait makers here in the US. Let me get one of these open. I love the one they're packaging. They do include how to rig it. So rigging tips, drop shot it. You could Texas rig it. Throw it on a shaky head for that smaller profile. This, this right here, when they're not hitting the bigger profile baits, this 4.5 inch is absolutely perfect. Last tournament season, my partner Ricky, Muffin as I call him, was throwing a chopped down bait that was about this size, kind of a very similar setup, on a, on a shaky head actually, and caught a four pound bass during one of our tournaments. And this June bug color is perfect. Great, you can do it in clear water, great for dirty water. Super stoked about that. Then, we got the classic 6.5 inch Dojo Worm. They recommend shake your head. I personally like this one, Nico rigging it or wacky rigging it. I've never tried wacky rigging it, as well as a Texas rig. And this is the Super Nog Fire. Okay, I love that. I love it. I love it. I love it. Let me get one of these bad boys. So, just like that smaller one, but longer profile. Check that color out. Kind of reminds me more of that earthworm style texture. It's got some green, red, purple flake in there. Yep, you can smell the bass syrup. I love it. And I love the style of this. Let's see if I can get this to show. But check that spear point style tail out. That thing just gives, well, as you can tell, it just gives it plenty of action. And it kind of gives a nice float while we're going. Get that back in the bag. Then, oh, making a mess here, guys. Making a mess. Oh, snap. Okay. 
I have not tried these from Third Eye Fishing yet. This is just their good old fashioned sticks. This is a watermelon pearl holographic. It's a 5.25 inch stick bait. Shake your head it, Nico wacky rig it, or use a 4 aught Texas rig. Good to know. I didn't realize it recommended hook size there. I learned something new here. Oh, guys, this color's fire. This is, like I so, said, once again, this is the Watermelon Pearl Holographic. Check that out. Love that color. Beautiful style stick bait. Very simple. Nothing crazy. I could, I could see myself wacky rigging this. Oh, yep, just like that. Get that pearl in the bottom. Very durable. Love that. Love it. Love it. Love it. Okay. Then we got perfect. We've got every size of the dojo, guys. We got the 3.25 inch. You Ned rig this. You can drop shot this. You can throw it on a finesse jig trailer. And this is the Alabama Crop. I know a lot of my guys in the south, you're gonna love this color. Those of you up north like me or in the Midwest, you're gonna like it too. That is just a tasty, tasty little Ned rig. Get the close up on that color there for you. Tasty little Ned rig. That thing will just be dancing, dancing, dancing. Guys, we're not done. We are still, still going. Oh my God. Okay, if you didn't get the splash pack, you do get a face shield. Get that out of the way. Oh boy. I've been wanting to order these, but every time I go to go order them, they sell out, guys. We got a pack of the Third Eye Exclusive Samurai Swimmer. This is the, it's a four inch, five count, green pumpkin. Here's where it comes in. Let me pull one of these out real quick. I'm making a mess, so that's fine. So, standard paddle tail, but check that out there at the end. That little tail there, oh my God. Go check their Instagram page out. They have some videos of this thing swimming. The ribs here to add that little extra. This tail gives it such a unique action. I actually will prefer throwing this based on the videos I saw probably like on a chatterbait um, or something along that nature. I am just having the worst time with this clamshell. That's me though, guys. I, me and clamshells don't get along. That's not their, their fault. This is totally my fault. It's great packaging. I just, I suck. So I'm gonna get these back in here real quick. But like I was saying, I like throwing them. I, I think I'm gonna be throwing this on a chatterbait, swim jig. Um, I guess you could go like, you know, a belly hook of some sort, but this definitely with the action will look really good on some sort of jig or bladed jig trailer. Um, this is just a good trailer bait. You could throw it by itself though. All right, now that I've got these guys back in. Whoop, there we go. We still have more. We're not done guys. Okay. Well, here's something you could throw those Samurai Swimmers on, actually. So this is a two-pack of the 3 8 ounce. That's a great weight, actually. This is their kickstand jig. And they have a video of this guy as well. So, kind of like a swim jig. But if you notice, it stands up. The beauty of this is you can take that Samurai Swimmer. Got a little nice, ooh, light, light. We got I like the lightness, green pumpkin. You can swim this. You could also jig it, let it sit, let that bait flutter, bounce it. So you've got a lot of different ways you can present the bait with a jig like that. You could also throw some of those dojo worms on there. Then we got, actually, for the jo dojo worms, you did get 316 ounce, great weight, two count of the shaky head EWG hooks. Let me get one of these out. Ooh. Let's see here. You guys, I just suck at opening these things, but you know, it's what you get. Very nice. I like the EWG style hook that they did on this. Great screw lock there. Awesome stand up profile. You could throw the smaller ones, the longer ones, the stick baits. A lot of the baits that we just got in the box you could throw on that hook set right there. 
Then, I love, okay, 1 16th out. Love this weight when I'm doing Nico Reggae. These are actually a different style of Nico weight. So a lot of guys are used to the nail weights that you shove into your worms. These right here are kind of a screw in weight. I just dropped a couple on the floor. I'll pick them up when we're done. But that screws in to the bait. You get this little head there. Nice sleek profile. That I like using the 116s because it allows that bait to still flutter naturally and it's not just gonna pull it down. Now obviously if I'm fishing heavier, um, not necessarily cover, but heavier current, uh, stronger water flow, yes, I will do on something a little heavier to kind of keep it in place. Then, the very last thing they did, because you're gonna fall in love with third eye fishing so much, if you haven't already, get this guy open here. Where I put this actually on my truck. They did give us a decal for the car as well. So, I'm out of breath. Guys, that was, that's, that's probably the best takeover box I've seen in a long time, especially from a from a small business. Um, that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten things in this box. No wonder we needed a bigger box. So, let me know your guys' thoughts. If you've got one of these, make sure you guys are doing hashtag hooked on Hendrix when you catch something. Any baits, if you got a bait from last month's box, box box before, uh, splash packs before, take a picture, upload it on Instagram, tag Hendrix Fishing, and use hashtag hooked on Hendrix, and you'll have a shot at winning some free baits as well. And we'll even showcase some of you you guys in your catches is on the on the page. And like always, if you want to save some money while you're ordering, code part time ten. But guys. I'm gonna let you guys get on the water. And as always, good luck out there. I need to get out on the water with these baits and catch some stuff myself. So, till next time, good luck, and I'll see you out there.